Hello guys, welcome to the next episode of City Skylines with me, Biffa. Thank you very much for joining me. I've just noticed the traffic that's coming down here, that's coming along there, that's going up here. Why are these guys cutting through here? Ah, oh, because they should be going all the way around the outside if they want to get somewhere. Hmm. That's a bit annoying, isn't it? I mean, it's moving. It's moving. I'm wondering whether I should have another connection <laughs> coming in somewhere. We'll see how that goes. That is backing up quite far. As long as it keeps moving. Hmm. Anyway, yes. Yeah, so, we built this area last time, didn't we, down here? I'm just looking at these little buildings down here. There's a few new things that I haven't spotted before. Law firms. Oh, these are upgraded offices. Nice. Okay, that's good. And I was just wondering how much, how many people we had in this area here. So I was going to make a little district just for this little section here. And then we're going to do some simple mathematics. That's it. You've joined City Skylines videos for some maths. There we go. Park Square. So what have we got in here? We have a population. Oh, that went up suddenly. <laughs> 6,750. And it's is it rising... Yeah, okay, so let's say 7,000. We are how far away from our target? Another 100,000 would be 140,000. Let's round it up. So another 120,000. And we're getting about, I reckon we'll get 10,000 in there. So we could, with little areas like that, we could easily hit our target because we can't buy any more squares. Oh, we can buy another square. <gasps> oh, we maybe have one more square to buy. And that'll be down here because of these roundabouts. Okay, yeah, I'd forgotten about that one. But I'm glad this one is working out okay. And we're still constantly growing. We do need... Hmm, let's have a look. Let's have a look around here. Oh, I'm liking some of these buildings. Real high-density stuff. That is looking cool. They've got, like, tennis courts. Look at that. Tennis court and basketball courts on the top. Because of normally using mods, I don't get cities that go that far because they tend to... What's the matter with you? The building is empty. Okay. How much is stored? Do, 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 do. Okay. Because they tend to get to a certain point um, and then the mods break or something like that. But this is going fantastic. What are we getting in here? Not so many people coming in there, but that's okay. So let's add, we need, definitely need a load more offices, uh, a load more, a load more industry. Let's add in, mm, let's see, let's add in a load of industry along here and fill this section up. Where's the, yeah, that'll be going there. Now that's it, excellent. We're just going to cram this four and get as much in here as we can. I mean, it may be at some point, because we have the low density residential area nearby it may be at some point that we do actually change this over here and make it high density possibly although it's like the outskirts of the city the other side where the hard-working people that go to the factories live there we go i think that's going to be a different size yep we'll leave that one we may as well just run these all across here and add that in as well Oh, I'm just looking at the traffic on the right-hand side of the screen. What's going on here? Hmm. Okay, so people that want to come off there. I'm just wondering whether we could make that... Make that some sort of junction. Hmm, I might look at changing that in a moment. Although it's not too bad, as usual. Everything is moving. Everything, as long as it moves... I'm not too worried. Okay, let's get water in here as well. Fill all this thing up. There we go. Let's go here. <laughs> nope. Let's go there. And then we can squeeze one more in. There we go. We'll ignore ignore those bad layout, laid out pipes. <laughs> ignore them, ignore them. Okay, let us just fill this all up. I'm going to do this whole section. There we go. Yep, and we'll leave that outside bit. Yeah, that should be okay. How's Crater Lake looking? Yeah, not doing too bad. Okay, let's take a look at our... So that's okay. That It's like every episode, we need to add in... We need to add in more water. And let's put in two of those. And another one of these. 
just to make sure. There we go. And these two as well. Excellent. Oh, helicopters are hard at work. Where are they going? Oh, they're picking up water. Oh, is there a fire somewhere? Yes, here we go. They're coming over here. Oh, wow. That is a big fire. It's taking out the pear building. Is that is that what they sell? All they sell is pears. Maybe, I don't know. <laughs> okay, well, they're dealing with that. That's fine. Okay, let's have another look. Yep, good. Ooh, incineration status. Now, I know we've got some down here. We could probably do with some more spread around up here somewhere. Hmm. I'm wondering maybe whether we just add... Let's just add two more onto there. Hopefully, I mean, the traffic is pretty much... Oh, that's parked cars. The traffic is pretty much non-existent around here. So, apart from this bit, this worries me. Although it is moving. I bet if I disconnected that. Because the idea was that they would come in the top and go around there. I'm going to disconnect this bit of road just here. Don't drive on the grass. And I bet that'll move a bit quicker. Because they should go up and round. And it just leaves a bit more space. They're going to go in there now. Well, anyway, it's moving. Let's not worry about it. Okay. Oh, elementary schools. Okay. Oh, it's hard to tell exactly where we need them, uh, which that can also affect traffic. Now, we recently upgraded all of this, didn't we, to high density. So, I bet this is a problem in here. In fact, I can pretty much guarantee that it is. Let's add in... Oh, space already occupied. Okay, can't do it there. There we go. They were unhappy about something anyway. So we'll add a school in there. We'll knock their building down and say, sorry, we're going to have a school. Oh, look, there's some spare spots. Let's add two more up here. And a high school. Let's add two high schools. University is probably okay. We've got one there, one there. And one here. Yep, no, that's fine. Good, good. Let's check out our happiness. Everybody is pretty happy. Apart from some of the commercial people. But we can deal with that. Health and death care is fine. Cemetery usage just filling up. But that's alright, we can deal with that. This one I barely look at. This is the upgrade whether they're going to upgrade or not. So, well, they'll, they'll upgrade when they want to. Not worried about that. So, to the traffic. Let's have a look. Fine. This area is doing fine. This is busy, but it's moving. In fact, all it's done is move the problem on a bit, hasn't it? I'm just wondering whether I should disconnect these roads up, up here. So, instead of going across there, they have to go up here. And then up and down the middle. Do you know what? I think that might be a good idea. Let's take the... Oh, what's going on? Are these... Oh, that's the problem. Look. I haven't got the mod that... There we go. Look, they couldn't get round because that piece of road was going the wrong way. Let's just check this all the way round. That's going up. That's going up. Or anti-clockwise, I should say. Because now it's going down, 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 down and out. That was the problem. Well, there we go. We found what it was anyway. Uh, let's fill these back in again then. And that probably won't be an issue anymore. Let's see. So they can cut through here if they need to. But if not, they should just carry on. Are they all going down there? No, some of them are coming up. Brilliant. That's what it was. I was accidentally stopping them from getting from where to where they needed to be. Good. Okay, that's fine. Let's check out over here then. Now, this one's super busy. And this one is backing up. So they're basically trying to get... Hmm, not entirely sure. 
That's busy, but that's not backing up too bad. So generally speaking, I mean, the way's in. Oh, wow. What's going on here? Traffic busting today, by the look of it. Mm, it's moving. It's moving. I think it's just too many junctions. I really wish. I know you can do it with mods. I know that, but we're not touching the mods. Is I wish you could have that feed into there without stopping this because this side shouldn't have to stop I mean I know they're stopping anyway because of that but quick sip of tea hmm it needs some sort of funky clever junction there doesn't it but yeah it's moving so we'll sort of not worry too much that's busy but it's moving that's good this is always busy and it's getting busier. Hmm. What's this guy here saying? Oh, they've still got not enough food. Yeah, this is the problem, isn't it? We need to get some more of this. I think these lower residential stuff... Uh, lower, I keep saying residential. Lower industry stuff is what we need. I'm just looking through here. Are any of these actually making food? Or do we just need some farms or something? Um, let's have a look at... <laughs> Not escape routes. Natural resources. Okay, so we could put farms there. And we could put farms down here. That's about the only... Oh, this could all be farms. Look. Okay. Let's paint this district here. And try and change this to farms. I'm not saying that's going to particularly solve our problem, but there we go. Let's see. Uh, Maple District, no. Let's click down here. Let's click Industry Specializations and Farming Industry Bonk. Let's see if that will change to some farming. Uh, what have we got in here? So we've got a train station. I think these are offices, aren't they? Yeah. Is it just this little bit that's fertile? I think it is. I mean, this bit's really fertile around here, but... If we do... I mean, we could just, like, squeeze a couple of farms in there. Oh, let's fill that in again. Yeah, let's make this its own little industry. Okay, let's get rid of that. There we go. And down here. The Vermont District. It's teeny, it's tiny, but it's going to fulfill a purpose. Hopefully. Let's see what happens. Is that big enough? Just about big enough, I think. I might just slightly make that bigger. There we go. Make sure that one's covered. What have we got? Ready to wear limited. Well, you'll probably change at some point. Not enough workers. Yeah, I think we need more people. Could expand this section over, couldn't we? I mean, I'm wondering whether to change some of this to upgrade it to high density because that's like a. I mean, look at that area. That is a huge swathe of houses there that could all be upgraded to high density stuff. I'm loving the solar panels on the roof. But it really feels like a. It really feels like a normal sort of estate, doesn't it? When you come down and look at it at this level. So what do we reckon? I reckon... Let's have a look. What have we got here? What do we say? Like some of the outside ones? How about we do two rows down here? All the way down. If we do it like this... Like, uh, oh, that's going to take out the shops. Yeah, in fact, I'm going to do the whole lot, and then we're going to upgrade the shops as well. Let's do that. Ah! Everybody's going to be leaving. Let's change this 
all the way down to that. I know there's the shop section as well. And then what we're going to do is... Go along here and add these high-density shops back in. There we go. I know that's probably going to make a few people unhappy. And they're going to move out, but never mind. Let's get rid of those. One, two, three, four is the width we need for that side. One, two, three, four that side. And we do the same here. Although that's, I think that's police and fire engine, so that's fine. There we go. We've got the power going up the middle. I could remove that, couldn't I? Let's get rid of that. There we go. One, two, three, four. Yep. High density. And the same here. Oh, we don't seem to have it that side, do we? Let's add some in here anyway. Might as well fill up that gap. This side here. I mean that's going to increase the traffic over here, but we'll see we'll see how it goes. Okay, it's building up. Good good. I wanted to remove some of those power cables. Look, there's some that don't need to go right into here. Uh, oh, these go oh they go along the back. That's fine. These ones here. There were some that crossed up the road. Here we go. Let's get rid of these. Hoping that's okay. Yeah, everybody's sharing the power. We're fine, we're fine. I think that was it, wasn't it? Yep, there we go. Whoa, big reconstruction project going on there. Excellent. That's what we want to see. Let's speed that up a bit then. Try and get some more people in there. How's our parks and stuff doing in here? Probably could do with a couple more. Let's stick a couple of small ones in. This one here. Oh, is that not fitting that gap? No. Oh, that one. There we go. Let's add that in. And we'll do one of those there as well. And we'll just put one on the outside just to try and cover that area. And hopefully, let's have a look. How much is that land worth? <laughs> yeah, this is worth this is worth more. I suppose it's going to go up when more people move in. Hmm, we shall see. And then, oh, there we go. Look, we've got farms over here being built. Fills fields. Excellent. Ready sliced fruits. Good, good. Yeah, the food factory. Okay, so it'll be interesting to see whether that then starts to make a difference to these places. Not enough food. Yeah, we shall see. We shall see. I don't know whether that, I mean, I'm assuming they can also get food from the outside. If people come in from the outside, they can bring that in. How's this going over here? Oh, look at that. The traffic. Yep. Traffic's moving nicely. That solved that problem. Excellent. I thought I'd designed this well. <laughs> and I'd done a good job. I don't know quite how it wasn't working out right, but... There we go. That's good. I'm just looking. I mean, all things considered, the size of the city, 134,000. We're losing a few people. They'll be moving back in. Don't worry about that. We have an absolute ton of money. There we go. Look, they're, they're coming in. Let's have a look at some of these monuments and things and see if we can try and get some of these in our city. Um, they're going to bring in... I mean, what we want more is people, don't we? We want we, we, we just want people to come in and, and live in our city. These are going to bring in tourists, but they're also going to give us some benefits as well. So... Increases the profile, removes pollution. So obviously that's good. Um, this one, all the all the energy we're ever going to need. Uh, lots of tourists for that one. So maybe we'll leave the tourist ones. Medical centres would be good. So lots of medicine for everybody. Hadron Collider. Uh, don't need to worry about education. And the Doomsday Vault. What the heck's that? A huge underground facility that helps shelters in your city to work more efficiently. It allows all shelters to stockpile more water and food and to raise their capacity. Oh, okay. Hmm. Let's maybe work towards that. It's telling us to build 
the disaster memorial. So what's that going to be? Sparkling Unicorn Rainbow Park. Wind Floodland. Oh, okay. We haven't done that one. Um, what's the disaster memorial? Sphinx of Scenarios. Win any three scenarios to gain the... Oh, right. Okay. Um, right. Let's start down here. What have we got? These are touristy things. Luxury Hotel. Fantastic Fountain. Driving Range. Casino. Statue of Wealth, Nazareth Plaza, Plaza of the Dead. I think this means we've already got these, haven't we? Yes. Life and Death, Friendly Neighbourhood Park, Disaster Memorial. Oh, there we go. Oh, we've got to experience a tsunami before we can build that. Oh, okay. Won't be doing that one then. Um, what would be a good one would be health because we've got to make sure that this stays that just happens 20,000 people oh there we go look people are moving in again excellent um so what do we need to do to get the medical center construct high interest tower okay transport tower it's going to be one of these isn't it that's colossal order offices official park courthouse tax office high interest tower there we go Many companies like to have offices in it because of the lovely view. Requirement for the medical centre. That is a pretty big tower. I think we want to put that in our downtown area. Somewhere that's going to really help with the view. I think in here somewhere. This little section here. What's that there? We've got playgrounds. <laughs> Basketball court. I've got to stick it right next to a playground. How big is it? Oh my goodness, it's huge. I don't even think it's going to fit in here. Okay, it will fit in here. What have we got here? So it would end up taking out those few buildings there. Okay, let's do that. Sorry, people. Is that as far up as it would go? There it is. The high interest tower. Look at that. Wow. Well, that certainly adds something to the view, doesn't it? Let's get... Oh, man, I'm loving how these buildings look. They're looking fantastic. Let's get a screenshot of that. Well, that's not the screenshot button. Let's try that again. Let's get a screenshot of that. That'll be the screenshot button. Excellent. High interest tower, a large office building. So people are going to visit that as well, are they? Okay. Is that particularly noisy? Yes. Well, <laughs> what can we do about that? Has that like added to the value of the area? It has. Look at that. That's really added to the value of this area here. Well, oh, it's just fitted in nicely, isn't it? Fantastic. Let's just add. Let's just add a few more trees around here. So it's got a nice little park. Cool. I like that. There we go. That's the high interest tower. So then the medical center. Construct the courthouse. Um, I saw that one, didn't I? This one here. No, that's the tax office. Oh, okay. Courthouse. There we go. Handles all kinds of legal business your citizens have. Requirements in the medical center. A lot of upkeep. That's a pretty big building as well. Oh, actually, it's not too big. Um, let's come out of that menu so we can have a look at this properly. There we go. It's not too bad in size. I'm wondering whether we could... We could do with increasing the value of this area over here. Could we add a road in for it to... Hmm. Sort of off the motorway or maybe down this side. Let's have a look. If we have a road come up here, would it fit in? What's that building there? Okay, you're going to end up going. Sorry about that. Let's have this one here with the trees. So that's like as close as possible to here. Oh, it's massive. Bigger than I thought. It's going to wipe out a couple of things over here. But you know what? 
Oh, it won't fit in because of the load. Oh, darn it. Darn, darn, darn. Okay, let's delete that. I bet it would fit in this way. Yes. Well, let's put it in and have a look. Ooh. Oh, there's all these people running everywhere. Did I just like, destroy a bus stop or something? Or are they all run out of the buildings? I don't know. <laughs> so the courthouse, it's near all these great big shops. So you come down here shopping one day, spending all your money, and then you come around the corner and there's a massive courthouse. I actually quite like that there. I think that looks all right, doesn't it? Yep. Screenshot of that as well. Nice. So I probably will go around and pretty up these buildings at some point in the future but at the moment i just want to get these get this medical center so lazarette plaza let's have a look i've seen that one around it's got to be one of these big ones isn't it oh maybe it isn't okay what's that wealth lazarette plaza there we go I think that would actually fit in well by this. I wish you could rotate these so it doesn't go like sideways. It went up and down next to that. Is there anywhere else that could do with... Yeah, look. Let's look in here. We could really do with increasing this area here. That's where it's going to go. There we go. We shall fill in the little gaps with some trees so it doesn't look too bad. Nice. So that's like a tourist. That's like a tourist thing as well. Yep. That's beefed up the leisure in that area, which hopefully will make people happy. I mean, that's... Oh, look, people are leaving. Please don't leave. Oppression office. That's probably going to make people leave, isn't it? Uh, seeing skyscraper, theatre of wonders, expo centre, service and services, science, the oppression. This has got to be it, isn't it? The oppression office. When in need of oppression, we go to the oppression office. Okay. Man, we're spending so much money. They could do with leisure over here, definitely. They've got the prison. They've got the power plant. I don't know, though. It doesn't seem like the sort of area where you'd have, like, a, a good-looking office like that. Let's see. This section here. Yeah. What I want... How big is it? Okay, it would fit in there. If we had a little road coming up here... Like, coming off of... I want it there, but I don't want to get rid of that building. Yeah, like that. Hopefully it's going to fit in there. Yes, there we go. So the impression office even gets its own little area. Tucked in the middle of all the buildings that are grown up around it. So it looks like it's an old building that's been there for a long time. And then as progress has gone on, they've all built up around it. Look. Cool, that is looking good. So we've got that one. Are we there? Is that all we need? No, there's more. The Mall of Moderation. Oh my goodness. That's one of these, isn't it? Expo Center, Science Center. I know I looked at these a minute ago. Sea and Skyscraper. Okay, hang on. It's got to be here somewhere. No, it's not that one. Right, okay. I'm going to start from the beginning. It's not the statues. No, we remember that now. Transport Tower. Mall of Moderation. Here we go. Let's spread this out again. Let's get some leisure. Now, there's a lot of people living over here. Let's get the Mall of Moderation so they can come and shop here. Yep. There we go. What is with the pigs and the cows? Oh, yeah, the farming district. <laughs> I forgot about that. There we go. So they can come and shop in the Mall of Moderation. And I'm wondering whether I'm going to put a connecting road along here. I think I will, actually. I'm going to connect this. Yes. Let's do that. Before people start building it up 
too much in there. I think it's one of those. Oh, we can't. What's that there? Road maintenance depot. That's okay. You can move. Uh, let's move you over there. Oh, incinerator plant. What a bad place for those. That is like a really bad place. Um... I fit two in over there. Yeah, let's do that. Yikes. There we go. Excellent. So that's going to hopefully help some of the traffic go around the corner. How's that doing? Let's... Probably don't need to do that, but it's redundancy. Do we have it now? Oh, man. The sea and skyscraper... That was one of these ones over here, wasn't it? Service services. Service, da, 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 da. Expo. There it is. It's that one. Transport tower. I just looked at that. <laughs> here it is. We must be almost there. Surely. The sea and skyscraper. Um, I want that in the middle here again. Oh, let's go for one of these areas here. Look. There we go. Well, that's made everybody happy. Nice. Yep. Let's increase the leisure in that area. Is that it? Yay! The medical centre. So fast and efficient that it easily takes care of all of your citizens' health needs. Has a helipad. Can accept helicopters. It's pretty big. Let's have a look. So, I mean, the healthcare is darn good everywhere. But I want it sort of in in this high-rise area over here. Here we go. This is where it's going to go. Right there. Excellent. I bet you wish you hadn't moved out. You've missed out on having the best medical treatment ever in the history of my city. Look at that building. It's a shining beacon of medical treatment. It's fantastic. So fantastic. I'm going to get a screenshot of it. Guys, I hope you've enjoyed this episode. We've done quite a few things. We are getting there. We are getting there. Let's have a look. 135,000. Oh, man. We're going to do it. I'm sure we are. If you've enjoyed, hit the big B with the tea stain to subscribe to my channel so you didn't miss out on the next episode. And I will see you guys very soon for the next episode of City Skyline Natural Disasters. Take care. Bye-bye.